Good morning, everybody. Everybody out there in YouTube land and YouTubers. How you doing this morning? Well, I'll tell you, I woke up happy as happy can get. But I was a little disappointed when I looked outside. I looked outside and saw the fog. You see, I had I had intentions of going going out to uh that place Dunkin' Donuts to get me some coffee and a glazed donut. That was my intentions. But then I looked out my bedroom window as I always do. Had my hair comb, you know, I had my hair comb and everything and uh dressed, had my clothes on, and I was ready to get to move well not this early, you know. But this was my intentions. Because I got up, had me a nice, big banana. Because I like apples and bananas. And so I had my banana, took my medication. I was ready. And uh, I look out and I see all this white stuff. I almost thought, what is it snowing outside? Wait a minute, I thought, see, I thought I had turned the TV off. See, I think I need a new battery or something, because sometimes I got to make sure that when I hit that button to look, to make sure that the television is off. Oh, well, it's off now, which I'm not going to be on here that long. I just came up here to do my little vlogmas this morning, and I was going to take y'all along for the ride, but I said, hey, I might be back in the bed by that time, you know, by the time the fog burns off, and so I decided to just go ahead and get it done. already ate my banana, took my meds, did my little wash up. I was going to wash my hair, but I, I probably still wash it. I may still wash it a little later on. And, uh, you know, did little necessary things around the house. Took out me some stew beef, because I'm going to make stew beef today. <sighs> well, you know, that's going to be easy, because all I got to do is put it in the pot. I don't really have to watch it, except, you know, to make sure the water don't boil out or anything like that. And so, I got to wait till that thaws out. I was thinking, should I cook the whole pack, or should I cook a half a pack? And then I said, if I cook a whole pack, that will last me probably a whole week. But then, see, see after I cook and uh, eat on it for a couple of days, three days, probably max, then I'm tired of it. I want to move on and go and get something else. You know, I don't want to just sit around and eat the same thing on a daily. You know, that's inhumane. Well, I wouldn't say it's inhumane, but, you know, the average person doesn't want to do that. And so... I might just cook half of it and have enough for today and tomorrow. Tomorrow is Sunday. Yeah, tomorrow is Sunday. Oh, let me report about my mirror, y'all. I don't know if you can still see it, but it, I don't know if you can see that or not. There's a mirror. I mean, the lamp. Let's see. This is horrible. I'm a terrible photographer. Okay, there it is. It's right above the lamp. There's the mirror still standing. Yep, mirror still standing. That's my son when he was a little baby. He wasn't a little baby, but he was about four, three or four or something. Let's see if I can get the glare. Get that glare out of here. Yeah. I don't know where that glare is coming from. Oh, it's coming from here? I don't know. Unless, and maybe it's coming from the light. But anyway, wasn't he adorable? He was adorable. He looks just like his mom. Even right now, he looks just like... Well, you know, he resembles me. He resembles me. That's what everybody say. And then my daughters resemble that ex-husband of mine. But they got some of my traits and some of my actions, you know. The good and the bad, you know. So, there you have it. It's a mixture. It's a mixture. That's what they are. They're a mixture. And, uh, whew, boy. You know, I'm just getting out of breath for no reason. 
I just that little bit, I got up and went over there and showed to show y'all, and that's not even three feet. Well, I say it's three steps for me, but to, for me it's three steps. And I walked over there to show you the mirror, trying to get a good shot of the mirror, you know, that I had put up yesterday morning. And it's still standing. I had put it up with the command strips I had ordered from Amazon. As a matter of fact, I got another um, uh, picture that I'm going to put up. But I don't know exactly where I want to put it. I don't like a whole lot of stuff on the wall. You know, it makes your house look too cluttered. Well, that's the way I feel about it. Too cluttered. But I do have this picture. And I'm trying to think, where the heck did I get this? Let me show you the picture. It's not a great picture. It's only a picture of uh, some flowers. And, and I'm thinking about, I don't know where... Let's see. Oh, boy. I'm pulling everything out, y'all. See? A little picture of some flowers. Nice frame. I should almost take that them flowers out of there. And it's got a signature on the picture. I don't know. I think I probably got it from my mother. Because my mother used to like to go to the antique shops and uh, flea market. You know, stuff like that. But it's a nice... I like it. I like the picture. And it's got to be cleaned up. Because I think it's... I really think it's sort of smoked up from when I used to smoke. Which was four years ago. I haven't cleaned it. It's been stored up there. See? I'd take some alcohol or something, or either some Windex, or probably clean it right on up. But then I don't know where to put it. And like I said, I was thinking of just taking it out and put a picture of my one of my uh, loved ones in here. And uh, let me show you the back. See, if I use the command, I don't know how all that happened. See there? See, if I used the command hooks, I would have to take all those staples out. And they want you to take all that stuff off. And then they say, don't, um, don't take, take the strip to, um, uh, paper. Now, this whole back is full of paper. I mean, except for here, so I would have to, I don't know, maybe I'll just use this little strip right here. I don't know, I think I had it before I moved here, which was eight years ago. That's the last time I had this up. And, uh, I'm trying to think. I must have used, um, uh, what do you call them? Um, like something like a thumbtack, but it's a little tiny nail that hardly makes a, it just makes a little prick in the wall, which, you know, this is what I've been trying to avoid. I was trying to avoid putting any holes in the walls at all. Because, uh, you know, over here, they don't want you to put uh, holes in the wall. And all of my walls basically are, well, they're bare. I have, I don't have anything on my wall. I just put that, stuck that picture up there with my son the other day. And I put the mirror up there. And then I had this mirror over here. This one, of course, has been up here for a long, long time. And I've got the other one in the bathroom. I think I was talking about that the other night. And then the uh, little Chinese lady right there that was given to me a friend many, many years ago. And I thought about putting her on the wall. But where on earth was I going to put it? And then my, um, I says my daughter or my granddaughter one was telling me that I should put my television on the wall. But I got an old television. This television is old and, um, I said, if I put the one in the bedroom up there, you know, I have to get somebody to put it up there. My my granddaughter's husband, I mean, boyfriend, fiance, whatever he is, um, he's an electrician. I think he put his own t his TV, their TV up on the wall. But, you know, of course, if I got him, ask him to do something for me, you know, people want to be paid. And then I would have to get the, uh, what do you call that thing, the rack that you put it on? The mounter, the, the thing that you mounted on the wall with. I would have to get one of those. And, and I, like I said, I would, would rather have a bigger TV for the living room instead of this one. So I would have to switch this one up. 
because the one in the bedroom is a little bit bigger. But then I'm thinking, now look, look at this. I don't know if y'all could see that. See that? Now that's the bell, the bit, uh, the what do you call it? Doorbell, doorbell, and all its chimes and stuff up there. And so, and then there's, but I, 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 I think. Hold on, y'all. Let me play the guessing game this morning. Hold on. Let me get up. Once again. I think. I don't know if you can see this little thing here. I think this. I don't know if that goes to the doorbell or if that's where I can, you know, that he could actually wire, you know, do the wiring for the uh, television. I'm not sure. Because otherwise, I don't have a flat surface, you know, really available. Unless it's that wall over there where I got the, um, you know, the mirror. The mirror's on that wall over there. And where else? There's nowhere else. This is the living room, y'all. This is it. So, I don't know. I don't know why I'm thinking about that earlier this morning. Anyway, I'm thinking about my coffee from Dunkin'. I can make my own coffee, but I just want to get out of the house and go for I want to go for a ride if it's not going to rain. That's what I really want to do. I just want to get out there in the, in the breeze. Free-spirited. Free-spirited all around Grandma. Grandma gets around. She's all around. All around the town. And she's... Always doing something different. But I got to start doing something because I can get me some subscribers. But anyway, I might end up making me a coffee. I'll see what happens at 7 o'clock. It's about 6.30. It's about 6.35 by my clock. And so, I'll see what's happening around 7. But I don't want to leave here at 7. I probably, maybe around 8 o'clock. 8, 8.30, something like that. And I got some work I got to do. Look at that mess I done tore out of that thing. When I took this picture out, that's what everything, not everything fell out, but some stuff fell out. See, I got my, my little socks and, uh, you know, stuff like that, that people come to my house, take your shoes off, put on some of those. That's what I should have had it done all along. And this is my heating pad that my doctor, well, yeah, as you can see, it's hardly been used. It's almost still brand new. There's nothing wrong with it. Still works and everything. Let me put it back in here. And that's some more track. Oh. Ah, Excuse me, y'all. I'm doing the best I can do under the circumstances. Uh, okay. Everything's back. That's the sales paper, which is going in the trash. Some old clothes hangers in there. And, you know, when I get ready to take the trash out, hopefully later on today, uh, yeah. She's not going to take out so much trash. Too much trash. And the people never came by and picked up the bottles outside yesterday. So, these got to be added on to it. Let me see. Two, four, two, four, six, seven. So, I got to put those out there. I was thinking about taking the bottles back myself. You know, and then just start saving it. Just start saving the money and see how much money I could save. Because before, you know what? I used to refuse to buy water, you know, I would buy it once in a while, you know, or something like that. But now, see, I'm buying it on a daily, you know, I'm drinking it on a daily. And I'm trying to drink more water. Um, but when I buy all this water, then, you know, I didn't feel like taking the water, taking the bottles back. Because I didn't have it, you know, when you don't have transportation to do things like that. And so I put them outside as I figured, hey... Let somebody else use them since I'm not using them. And there used to be people, you know, out there in the dumpster uh, picking up bottles and, you know, soda bottles and stuff like that. Every once in a while I have a soda bottle because I don't buy soda that much like that anymore. <coughs> 
And so what I'm going to do today, as soon as the sun comes up, which I don't think it's going to come up, but as soon as it gets brighter outside, I'll take the box of bottles and put them in the front and see if anybody comes around to get them. And, um, you know, add those over there, the other seven to it. As a matter of fact, where's my... Oh, boy. Did I drink any water? I don't think I drank no water this morning. But I got one right here. Bottles been washed and everything. I still wash my bottles, y'all. I don't know what's going on with this corona. I'm just going to continue to do, you know, what I can do. I bought me some sanitizer, more sanitizer, hand sanitizer the other day. And look at my hands. All that from, you know, and I've been trying to, I bought, I ordered me some uh, gloves from Amazon so that I can, look at that, a dry crack. And I can actually feel them like they're cracked, you know. And so I've been trying to keep lotion on them to try to get them looking back like they were. And it almost looks like I'm dehydrated the more water I drink. I was like, what the heck is going on here? See? So, oh. Anyway, I'm going to put some lotion on them. And I bought some, um, Acu what's the name of this stuff? Acu for this. I bought some of this, and I have I had bought that for my feet to put on my feet to smooth out the the, the feet, and then I bought a big jar. I be buying so much stuff, y'all, that I don't use, but I think I'm gonna use some of that on my hand. That Aquaphor, it's supposed to be like really really good, uh, cause my uh, granddaughter had uh, and she had bought up. Uh, this one, I don't even think I ever used. I haven't. I have not. See, the actual four. I haven't used this yet. And what else is this stuff right here? I do not. I tried this stuff right here. This is uh, leave-in condition. That stuff makes my hair nappy, you know. I was like, what the heck is happening to my hair? I thought it was supposed to be like a gel type. It says leave-in conditioner repair cream. I think I used this stuff one time. Made my hair nappy. I said, heck with that. I'm not making my hair nappy now. This is the other thing. Is this leaking? Look at that on my finger. Is it leak? What the heck? Anyways, it's your making black castor oil. Bought that for my hair. You know, trying to help my hair to thicken up a little bit. And what's this other one? Now here I am all in here showing y'all this. You see how I get carried away? And this is uh the hair food. Black. It's uh Jamaican black castor oil coconut hair food. You think I'll be using that stuff? Nope. I've got coconut butter, which this is not for your hair. I'm just looking at the stuff in this cabinet, being that I'm in here. Coconut butter, that's got to be outdated. Got to be. And uh, that band aid. Now, Vaseline, and I bought some petroleum jelly, but I didn't get the. This is the origin, 100% original. This is what I want right now. But I bought that as a substitute. I mean, it's just not the same thing as Vaseline. I think every home should have Vaseline, and I think every home does. Just like every home has a Bible, I think every home should have Vaseline. Uh, wait, wait, uh oh, this is funny. This is funny. Waxed dental floors. Do you get it, y'all? Did you get that? <laughs> what do I need dental floors for? Hello. Oh, boy. Let me get out of here and put this stuff back that I'm tearing out here. 
this aquaphor. I don't know if that I don't think that tube in there is quite empty yet. So I'll just leave that there for a while. Now I got it. Where the heck did I get it from that I can't get it back, y'all? This stuff my daughter gave me a while ago. This stuff smells good. And I just put it in the bathroom. And this is what my grand, not my granddaughter, my daughter gave me. This smells pretty good too. She gave me, um, she gave me this and she got bath, bath and body work. It smells pretty good. I ain't gonna pull out all this stuff, y'all. I'm just trying to find a place so I can get the stuff that I pulled out back in here. That's all I'm trying to do. Uh, make this shit that tight. This here, this was some good smelling stuff. Dream Angels. That's a... Uh, what do you call that lingerie thing? Um, Victoria's Secret. That's what that is. My uh, son and his girlfriend have given me that years ago, and I just use it in the bathroom to keep this, you know, to keep the odor off down in the bathroom. I just... <laughs> Lord have mercy. I'm up here all... Huh? Ran to go this morning. You know how sometimes you wake up, you you feel real good, feel like you know blowing your horn. Do you feel like blowing your horn this morning? Well, I feel like blowing my horn, y'all, and I can't get out the house because let me look out the window again. Okay, I'm getting ready to close the video, y'all, because this has been too long. I didn't realize it. Okay, um, have a blessed day. I go with love. Bye bye.